It's been a while since I posted something. You got a problem with it? filming this today but I figured why not so I did it's a buddy time with my son which is the kind of buddy time I used to have with my dad Mike and I have done this all of his life Alexis and Ashley have done this with us too but the one who's wanted to do it the most consistently has been Micah especially as he got older it's probably been two years since we've done it and it's basically just coming out and what you do I'll show you in a second you bring your bag of your baseball stuff and you bring some baseballs your gloves obviously you start by having a catch with baseballs and then if you're wondering what i have in my mouth it's sunflower seeds you're welcome you have a catch you warm up there's a lot to a catch it's really a conversation that happens when you have a catch and then after we have a catch we go out and we we hit fungos to each other. Fungo is a terminology for hitting. There's a kind of bat. We don't have a fungo bat, but you hit fungos. You hit ground balls and fly balls to each other, and then we pitch to each other. There you go. Here's the basic layout when we get our stuff out and ready to go. Just like that. And then there's that thing. I was scared. Yo, Don't be intimidated by my power. That makes me very, very happy. Turn these two balls, man. Do it. Oh, yeah, baby. We are! It is getting a trifle bit warm in my armpits. I will do my best not to destroy you. Johnny! <laughs> <laughs> Y'all 
That one actually went to New Delhi. Nope, not today, my friend. I feel the need to send another one to Top Cara for a journey. Good for you, Atlantic! Bottom of the ninth. Two up, space is loaded. Down by three. <laughs> to the other field. <laughs> Woo! That's attractive. <laughs> now, we gather the balls into the bucket, like so. Two, three, four in each hand. And that's how we do it, ladies and gentlemen. We bring our Gatorade, our gum, our sunflower seeds and our nipples. Micah just left, but this is deep in my DNA. Um, earliest memories of my life are being on stage and performing or being on set, laughing and just being with my mom and dad. And then all of my childhood through all of my preteen years and my teen years, the overriding memory of childhood is the times I spent with my dad. My dad and I have spent thousands of hours on a baseball field or having a catch, playing stickball, pitching and hitting, hitting ground balls to each other, shagging flies. And um, there's one thing I've, I've never done is I've never forced upon my kids things I did as a kid with my parents. Um, Micah took an interest in basketball before he took an interest in baseball, which surprised me because my dad loved and played baseball. I loved and played baseball. Both my dad and I wanted to be Major League Baseball players. Uh, and when I saw Micah was born and he had big hands and then he was a lefty, I was champing at the bit because a big lefty. In fact, when we were playing up here, I walked out to the outfield and there was a guy who was watching us play. And he said to me, who is that? Is that Kershaw? If you don't know who Clayton Kershaw is, he's a pitcher for the Dodgers. But when you look at Micah playing, you realize that's a six foot four left-hander. And anybody who knows baseball, it's like, dang, man. A six foot four left-hander who can play ball. And when you watch Micah, you know he can play ball. So today was really, uh, fun and I didn't I wasn't planning to film it it just happened spontaneously and I'm glad I hope you got some laughs a little bit more about us and a buddy time that I spend with with Micah and this is the kind of thing that my dad did with me and I'm a lot like my dad so my dad was always making funny wise cracky jokes and being silly the roles were really reversed I do a lot of the things that my dad used to do uh, <laughs> so it's really fun I hope you enjoyed it and there you go, a video for the first time, and I don't know how long, but who cares who's counting, right? It's better to have quality than quantity, I say. Bye.